Hello and welcome to The Sims 3 Hunger Games Season 3. Let me introduce to you all of the new tributes. This should be a very fun season. Our first tribute or contestant is Miley Cyrus now. <laughs> I've called her Miley Cyrus. I think I called her Miley Cyrus Twerkin. Uh, let me see. Miley Cyrus Twerkin because <laughs> you'll find out why she's called that eventually. Um, but yeah, everyone wanted Miley on. I was like, yeah, I want Miley on too. Miley's like the it girl right now. And she's, I don't know, she's interesting to, to say the least. Uh, I, I can't say I'm like, da like, I don't care about the twerking stuff. Like that's not like, it's not, I'm not like going online. Like, Oh, I wonder who's twerking today. I wonder if Miley twerked today. Uh, but I've seen some clips and, uh, there were some scary moments from the VMAs that were a little horrifying. Uh, unfortunately you can have the Sims with their tongue hanging out. I thought that would have been a nice little touch. Um, but yeah, I think, I think Miley Cyrus twerking might actually win like I, I don't know i have a feeling that she just like she can't lose right now right guys like i don't know she just can't she's probably gonna win which is uh kind of scary now i present to you pre-twerk miley cyrus so it's miley cyrus versus miley cyrus in this hunger games well not there's a lot of other characters too but i thought this would be kind of funny uh i'm not sure she doesn't really look like the other miley cyrus the face i'm really bad at sim faces you guys are gonna have to cut some, cut me some slack there um but i definitely tw think twerking miley's gonna beat out this Miley. i think this miley might die right away i don't know i just don't have enough faith and if you want to see um her traits they're all there i also included party and i think Mo i think miley was always a party animal we just she didn't like quite throw it out there quite as much and now I present to you Grace from Facade. Uh, so many people have wanted Grace and Trip in the Hunger Games, and since that's such a that's a weird game, but it's it's a pretty popular series on my channel, so I knew they would be perfect for this. So first, Grace. Obviously, she has that Grace look on her face, um, I, and. Uh, she's grumpy, mean-spirited, neurotic, no sense of humor, unflirty, because, yeah, that's pretty accurate, so. And now we have Trip. <laughs> I don't know. I like, Grace and Trip are, they're, they're so annoying. I, like, I just want to punch them, like, because in that game, all they do is complain, and it's like, oh, I do not think they will win the Hunger Games, and if they do... I will, I will be really sad. I will be very disappointed in everyone else in this series because you cannot let Grace and Trip be you. That's just pathetic. Hermione Granger, book Hermione Granger, so she has the bigger hair. Because <laughs> Hermione was supposed to have really big hair. They didn't write the first Harry Potter movie, but it just wasn't quite right after that. So I gave Hermione the, the correct big hair she's supposed to have. <laughs> uh, she is, she's a genius, perfectionist, snob, ambitious, and workaholic. So basically, I mean, since Ron lost the Hunger Games, she has to like step up for the family and win this time, you know, or you know, their kids aren't going to have parents anymore. It's kind of sad. It's depressing, but I, I'd like to see Hermione win because I'm a big Potter fan. So, you know, Potterhead, whatever. <laughs> um, it it she needs to win we need to have one harry potter character win i mean it's i'm, I'm pretty depressed they haven't won yet especially ron when we gave him wizarding abilities which i'm not going to give hermione just because she can make food then it's just a mess and next we have pita malark a lot of you oh i spelled his name wrong whoops hopefully that's that's right right yeah that's what it looks like a lot of you wanted PETA since it was technically the Hunger Games and you guys wanted to see him because we had Katniss and she did really well. So I think he will also do really well. His traits are like, they're pretty good. Um, you can see friendly, athletic, charismatic, brave, natural cook. It's perfect. It's perfect. He may just win. I've also chosen the Terminator to commute. I know this isn't the create a character screen. I kind of, it didn't record for some reason, which is annoying, but I found out. So here he is. Arnold or the Terminator. I love the Terminator too. I just, I knew we had to have the Terminator because I don't know why it just felt so right. 
And yeah, I, I don't know. I think this will be good. This is awkward. So a lot of you wanted me to add awkward, the little character from our dating sim. So with Buttplu, he was in the first Hunger Games and he was like that go-to name for male characters whenever we did dating sims. His name was Buttplu. That was just what it was. And the girl version is awkward. So whatever dating sim we play, if the girl, if the... If the character we're playing is female, I've named her awkward because, well, I'm work. I explained this in the last Chrono days, but um, I'm working on a dating sim, and so well, coming up with a story for one, and I've named the girl awkward. So, and the main character is a girl. So, that is why I started calling girls awkward because I think it's funny, and I just chose randomized sim, and that's apparently what she looks like. So. Yeah, so if you're thinking awkward is like Chrono Day's character, it's just kind of like Buttplu, where it was just an over-encompassing name for um, female characters on dating sims. So, that's that. And a lot of you wanted awkward. Like, I get every video, there's like a million thumbs up on one comment. They'll be like, please add awkward to Hunger Games. So there you go. And that is your Sims Hunger Games Season 3 cast. Should be interesting. I don't know who's going to win. Let me know in the comment section below who you think will win and who should be the slave. This should be very interesting. And now we're going to move into our Hunger Games household. It was made by Super Poop. And if you guys have sent me a Hunger Games household, I have like a ton of them. So I don't know when exactly I'll use each one. But this one is by Super Poop. It's pretty cool. There's a little description if you want to read it. But... Well, you can pause the video and read it, or I'll leave a link in the description to the Sims Exchange thing. Uh, let's go. Let's explore this. You guys, there are fish splashing in the graveyard. What is going on? What? Zombies aren't what come back after you die. Apparently fish. Oh my god. No wonder it's called. Sleep with the fishes, see? There you go. Alright, this is exciting. I love exploring a new house. Holy crap! Look at all these fish! There's so many! There's a bunch of sharks. Oh my gosh, this is cool! So let's check out the house. It's really, really nice. I don't, I haven't, like, is this, I don't know if this is the um, winner's quarters or what, but it's nice. It's very nice. I believe it is for winners here. Yes. All right, that is the reward house. Which is beautiful. And now we will also check out. Let's see right here. This is the Hunger Games household. So it's kind of like a tower. I like that. All right, so there's their main eating place or kitchen and dining room. I just said place just to just to combine dining room and kitchen. It's just an eating place. Right, and there is the bathroom. Nice big bathroom, so hopefully they won't get stuck in there and bitch. Although they might get stuck on the stairs every now and again. I could see that happening. All right, two beds, which is nice. We'll probably remove one eventually um, once we get down to fewer characters. But yeah, very nice. I really like this. Oh, oh and this... I didn't even know. The pool is down in the basement? Nice. This will be cool. And it's already fenced off. Oh, this, this is going to be fun. I really like this house so far. It's pretty cool. Now, what is everyone doing? I'll allow them to be in the reward house right now, but not for long. Everyone's just hanging out in front of the couch. Peta's like totally blocking Grace's vision. She's going to freak out and start screaming at him if he's not careful. <laughs> What's Miley doing? Of course she's dancing. Why wouldn't she be dancing, especially in a mermaid outfit? That makes complete sense. She's dancing with herself. <laughs> She's dancing with pre-twerk Miley. Oh no, she's gonna turn pre-twerk Miley into twerking Miley. Holy crap. Miley and... Well, <laughs> and they're doing it to classical music. And I don't know what pre-twerk Miley... I don't know what the fuck she's wearing. This is very strange. I have a feeling both of the Miley's are just gonna become best friends with each other since they're the same person. Oh wow. That's wonderful. What's Terminator? Of course, he's gonna be swimming. Where's Trip? Of course, Trip would set himself apart and just be like, I hate everyone! Leave me alone! The Terminator was clumsy and fell into the pool? Really? He's a robot, though, technically. Like, he can't be clumsy. Some of our yard is in the ocean. Um, I'm not sure what's going on there! 
Oh man. I just like all the sharks. It's pretty amazing. I wish I wish they could swim in there. That would be great. Let's see if Miley, twerking Miley, can catch a shark. I know she can. Who's gonna be our slave? You guys need to decide that. Let me know in the comments. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be such a good... I have a feeling this is gonna be a really good season. Really funny and just great. I'm so excited. So, for the first episode, I'm not sure when that'll be. Probably Monday. Maybe we'll do tomorrow, Sunday. Because I wanted to do a video marathon today and I couldn't. I just kept having all this technical difficulties. First, my PlayStation, like... It, it was acting funny, and then Grand Theft Auto wouldn't load my story mode, which was frustrating, so I couldn't record that Let's Play. Ah, oh, it's just a mess, but I'm gonna figure that all out tonight and have the video marathon, hopefully tomorrow, hopefully it works. And so maybe we can have the first episode of Season 3 Hunger Games. Like if you're excited, and um, yeah, this should be interesting. Oh, is, is, is drama about to happen? Oh, I don't know. I see Grace moving, I'm like, she's gonna yell at someone. <laughs> Trip is, st <laughs> Trip is still all alone. He hates everyone. Oh my god, did a shark just... Did a shark just... <gasps> There's sharks in the bathroom too. There's sharks everywhere. Not everywhere, just the bathroom and, and <laughs> the little graveyard. Oh wow, this is gonna be awesome. Alright guys, have a great day and bye.